What's up, PG Squad? It's Megan. Today, we are opening up or catching 100 Mahi Mahi fish. You heard that right. Are you buying Robux or redeeming a gift card soon? Well, use star code MEGANPLAYS while doing so to help support the channel. Now, let's just get into it really fast. Basically, to get 100 Mahi Mahi fish, I need to buy 100 of these 600 bucks fishing rods. If we pull out the calculator, that is going to be 60,000 bucks, which really isn't bad. If we wanted to buy these out front to get 60,000 bucks, we would need to buy six of these 4,600 packages, which equals to about 27,600 Robux. So if you have no bucks and you're trying to do this, it would be about 27,600 Robux. Now, let's also look at these percentages because I don't know why Adopt Me did it this way. I don't know why they did it like out of 40 as opposed to out of 100. If you Google it, you can easily find out what percent is 31 out of 40. It is a 77.5% chance. Switch it to 8 out of 40. That is a 20% chance. And then switch it to 1 out of 40. That is a 2.5% chance. I guess they did it this way because to be like, oh, you have a 77.5% chance of getting the regular Mahi Mahi. That's like kind of odd. That's like a weird number to put. So here is our little reference sheet. I'm just moving it off to the side while we get started. So the first thing I have to do is buy 100 of these, which is gonna take some time, but really luckily it's not Robux, so it doesn't take as much time as you would think. And I can't accidentally open them like you do with the packages. Just watching the money drain is satisfying, but sad at the same time. Keep on buying, keep on buying. As long as I don't pass 100, that's good because if I pass 100, then I will be thrown off by the numbers. Oh, 90. Oh my gosh. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. We have 100 fishing rods. And before we do this, I need to count up how many mahi mahi I actually have. I've calculated these numbers so they will not interfere with our experiment to see if these numbers are actually accurate because they will be subtracted off. All right. Oh my gosh. Why does the mahi mahi look dead when it's stinking and tired? That is really concerning. Okay. Um, anyway, so let's just get started. You know, a good old, good old day of relaxing fishing and go. What's nice about this too, is you can actually do this a lot faster because as we can see the animation time, it takes a good amount of time. Oh, oh, a gold one for our first one. I like how it tries to jump out of the water and then it like fails every time. Maybe if we come over here, the animation will be a little bit, oh, we're sinking. will be a little bit smoother. And of course, if you buy these fishing rods, they're going to be right here underneath the food section. I feel like they would be under toys, but they're definitely bait where so they it makes sense that they're like with the goldfish and some of the other fun little additions. All right, let's see what we get for our second one. I think it's just a regular mahi mahi. What I like is it's kind of hard to tell. Ooh, he's swimming up. If you quickly like as we can see 14-3, if we go to our inventory and we quickly grab the fishing rod, throw it out and then go back to the pets, we'll already see that we got 15. It already decides what you get before all of these animations. So we'll do another one. I'll show you. So equip, throw it out, 16. It, it, see, we saw it change. We even saw it change. What I like too about these is you could just equip them and like you will lag your game out and your game will freak out a little bit, but you can also just like kind of rapid throw these out, which I like because I'm not trying to spend all my time just sitting here fishing. You know what I mean? So after you throw one out, it automatically like doesn't say it's equipped anymore. So you can just immediately equip the next one. Look at all these fish. Oh, a gold golden a regular <laughs> you can kind of see it come out of the water but not really i don't like this position and then look there's even still like some more fishing lures in there so <laughs> This is how you get the fish to just come to you. Oh, another gold. Okay, so the gold is a 20% chance. That's actually pretty high. Oh, another gold. Okay, but see the diamond, we should at least get two to three out of this whole experience. Oh, look, another gold. Oh my gosh, or I thought I thought it was a gold. Oh, there's another gold right there. When Adopt Me first came out with this kind of game mechanic, I was thinking, oh, if I just throw them out so much at one time, then they will have no choice but to give me the rare ones because the other ones will have to wait to respawn. It doesn't work that way. <laughs> if you go back to probably my first penguin video ever, I think this is when they first entered, ooh, become a, fan, a member of this channel. 
Um, guys, you should join. <laughs> this video came out on August 24th, 2019. And I was like, I kept on trying to throw it to where we would get the gold. See, I would throw it right there at the golden penguin in hopes that the other penguins wouldn't get it. But that's just like not how it works. I tried really hard <laughs> to bait the gold penguin. Anyway, lesson learned after, oh my gosh. I would ask if he's drowning, but I know he can swim. Uh, anyway, after years and years, I, I learned that no, there's no rhyme or reason. You just kind of got to throw it out. Like I would look for lucky spots that I felt like you could get these pets from. I'd be like, oh my gosh. Yeah. If you go over here and you jump three times, you know, I was, I was foaming at the mouth for these legendaries. I mean, I still am, but really, oh, oh my gosh. I thought that was a diamond. It was not, it was not a diamond. I got my hopes up. I got my hopes up for nothing. It's fine. Look how many bobbers are in the water. That is so many. Give me a diamond. I deserve it. Look at this. Three of them at once. They're like, thank you, the Megan place. Thank you. You guys are so welcome. Oh, another gold. I feel like we've gotten so many golds. Uh, yeah, we have a lot of golds. I started with two and now we have 14. But no diamonds yet. But diamonds are supposed to be a girl's best friend. So why wouldn't the diamond fish want to come hang out? Okay, we're about halfway through now. At this point, we should have at least gotten one diamond. So let's see if these finish up and we get a diamond. I just, I just feel like we should. Okay, gold. Well, we will take all the golds, okay? We like the golds. Let's switch positions. Let's move over here. Let's see if we can get a little bit more of an interesting vantage point. What if we fish from on top of the palm tree? Oh, okay. Now we're up high. That's fun. The fish have to come really far. Look, they can't even get up here. He's like hopping like, please. Uh, hi. Uh, <laughs> hi. <laughs> They're doing their best, okay? They're they're really doing their best. We have thrown out officially 70 baits. We have 30 left. So let's see if we are able to get a diamond mahi mahi. If not, the one out of 40 stat, it's not looking strong. Because we should have at least gotten two, maybe three. <sighs> okay, let's take a look. Oof. No diamond yet. Out of 30 fishing rods. Or out of out of 70. That's a lot. Oh boy, am I stressed, guys. What if we don't get a single one out of 100? I would be, I would be just like really shocked. We are down to the last five. And I don't think we've gotten one diamond. I haven't seen a diamond, which has me really stressed out because I feel like we should have at least gotten one diamond. Okay, the final one, guys. The final fishing bait rod thing and go oh my gosh if it, if we don't get one diamond i'm going to have to i'm going to have to revolt okay i think that's it let's see <gasps> not a single diamond okay let me do some quick math all right guys here's my spreadsheet for a 77 percent chance we ended up with 77 percent of the regular mahi mahi that is very good for a 20 percent chance of the golden we ended up with a 23 percent chance of getting the golden we got 23 percent golden which is also pretty good but that leaves us with zero percent left to get a diamond mahi mahi and as you can see here was my number before after before after i think i'm gonna open up 100 more off of camera and I will let you guys know what we get. Okay, we're back. And are we ready to see what 200 spinning rods gets you? Da -da 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 -da. Woo! Okay, so we ended up with 136 Mahi Mahis, 50 Golden Mahi Mahis, and two Diamond Mahi Mahis. Now, of course, I already did the math for you guys. So on my second round, I got 73% of the regular ones, 25% of the Golden ones, and 2% of the Diamonds ones. I got my first Diamond one, 125 fishes in and then the server closed and updated it at 160 fish in and then at 170 fish in I got my second diamond mahi mahi so basically it's giving 1% chance. It's very low. So um, I wouldn't stress too much because I feel like these are going to be in the game for a long time, at least until they decide to rebrand the shop again. But um, they are also very rare. So let me know what you would trade for one. And don't forget to tune in tomorrow for another Adopt Me video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hashtag stay PG, stay kind, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!